Hey guys, here's a real quick tip. Um, last video I changed the uh, shocks, struts, whatever you want to call them out. Whenever you're installing ball joints, make sure the pins that go on the back of the uh, inside the nuts to hold the ball joint and nut on aren't protruding out to where when you turn your wheel it digs into this uh, rubber hose, brake hose. That's what happened to mine, whoever installed them before. Um, this is the part number for the passenger side at Advance. It was like $20 and some change. Uh, it's fairly simple to put on. Just make sure you use the 7 16 wrench, or that's how it was for mine for an 88 to a 98. You just undo this nut right here, being real careful, and it slides out. Take this uh, clip off and then pop this line out. And then those there's two bolts right there. Uh, I put mine on the back side because it's easier to get to and uh, I just put one bolt in it because because it's not going anywhere and then of course this part here of the hose that goes on the back of the caliper there's two brass washers that go on there make sure you reinstall those on there new ones and uh, then bleed the brakes but that's just kind of a tip if anybody's interested and you're having to change that hose out hopefully that helps you out a little bit if you got any questions or any comments uh, just leave something below uh, like the video if it was helpful or if you liked it uh, put a thumbs down if you hated it but anyway it's just kind of a, a quick tip on when you install your ball joints make sure those pins aren't sticking out to where when you're turn your wheel it doesn't dig into your brake lines it did it on both of mine who are installed them last uh, should have bent the pins out of the way but anyway just a little tip hope you enjoy your weekend thank you peace out